local people here are so friendly. They are, you know, uh, they always smile at you. <laughs> That's such a lovely gesture when you see local people here. Hola chicos, muy buenas noches. Bienvenidos de nuevo a mi canal Roberto Vagabón. Hoy estoy en uh, la ciudad de Isabela, ok? Such a uh, different uh, setup, like uh, I opened this video, ok? At night time. Why not, right? So I think this is the first time that I opened this video at night time, ok? Because, alright, I arrived here in uh, Isabela City, Basilan, uh, very late because the, the ship uh, or the vessel departed Zamboanga City uh, very late also. So, yeah, that's a consequence. And now here, uh, I'm, I'm already here in Isabela I already check in and I'm hungry of course because the time right now it's 7 20 in the evening and I haven't uh, eaten my yeah actually the what the last time I ate was breakfast in Manila this morning so I haven't done my lunch yet and also my dinner and uh, all right so let's try to find some dinner here in their famous boulevard here in the city of Isabela so okay I see some uh, grilled meat chicken uh, hello so yeah let's try to find those food because I'm really hungry I'm, I'm starving right now so what do you have here uh, oh dim sum yeah dumplings actually uh, what else okay uh, drinks all right here my favorite you know grilled chicken yeah different parts of chicken uh, yeah, legs, uh, breast part. Wala kayong, wala kayong table, no? Para mag-eat? Oh, okay. And they also have... Uh, liver, sir. Liver. Chicken. Yes, chicken liver. Okay. Ito, magkano po yung ano? Quanto vale ito? 40. Okay. Lahat, 40? Hindi. Yun, sir, 25, 35 yung legs, pati yung I see, okay. Alright. Very cheap, guys. Very affordable. Yeah. Okay, but uh, I'll try to, you know, check other places. But yeah, I'll come back here. See you, ah, uh, yes, sir. Okay, let's continue our quest. Yeah. Wow. Smells so good. Looks so good. Wow. Okay. And this is where they cook. Wow. It looks so fresh. Yeah. What else? Here we have. Um, uh, Fish, okay. Wow, I love that. Kuya, uh, magkano po to? 70. 70? Sorry, sorry. sorry. Uh, 70 pesos uh, per piece. Grilled fish. Not bad. Yeah. What else? Uh, dumplings. Yeah. Some dumplings. Okay. So I think I have already my uh, choice. Yeah, I prefer the chicken, grilled chicken. Um, I don't know which, which part, but I think it's uh, yeah, leg part or chicken. It doesn't matter. Yeah. And what else do we have here? Oh, some Chinese uh, dumplings. Yeah. Dim sum. Kuya, ano ito? Kuya, ano yan? Ano po ito? Pancake? Oh, okay. Pancake, wow. Pancake during night, why not? Right. <laughs> okay, what else do we have here? Ah, it's the same. Yeah, grilled chicken, different parts, innards, chicken liver, I think. And that's isau. Yeah. Perfect. What else? Ah, fish. Grilled fish. Yeah, so pretty much the uh, boulevard here they have in Isabella City is filled with uh, live action during night uh, filled with you know food stalls like oh uh, yeah it, it actually a food places grilled food grilled meat yeah chicken mostly yeah so that's why this kind of uh, this place here in Isabella is very busy at night yeah local people here are so friendly they are you know uh, they always smile at you <laughs> That's such a lovely gesture with these local people here. Yeah, really amazing. Really good experience here, guys. Yeah, okay. So I'll now uh, pick my food. I have choices already. Uh, 
Kuya? 72 no, yung fish. Sino? Magkano to? 60 yung alad yung? 60 na lang sa'yo. Ah, 60 na lang. Okay, sige. Uh, ito isa. At saka rice. Alright, so I, I've got my fish and uh, rice. And uh, ate, what's her name, te? Huh? Abigail. Abigail. Yeah, Abigail uh, actually gave me this one. So it's a perfect uh, pair for this uh, fish. So, yeah, let's go. Sorry, sorry. It's okay. And now the chicken. Uh, te, please uh, give me this one. Uh, yan, please. Dalawa yan, please, huh? Okay. <laughs> and they're going to cook it here. Amazing. And actually, they have sauce here for the chicken. So they have spicy, not spicy, and uh, ano yung iba? Sweet and sour? Spicy lang, sir, pati spicy. Ah, spicy and non spicy uh, choices only. Yeah. Okay. Usually, uh, three days ako niyan eh. Pagka sa biyahe. Dito, three days, yeah. So, babalik ko sa Zamboanga sa Sunday. Yeah. Yeah, we're in Manila. Kasi trabaho ulit. Locals here are actually a surprise. You know why I come here? Uh, I visit alone. Why not, right? <laughs> Hello, ladies. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> so, yeah, there. Okay, so thank you so much. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, sir, bye. Bye-bye. Okay, I've got my water. Now ready to go back to the hotel and eat this dinner. <laughs> All right, so I set up my food here, my dinner. So this is what I bought uh, from the boulevard, you know, from the seaside. So the chicken, the fish, and then they have this, uh, okay, it's actually uh, lato. We call it lato. Yeah, it's a seaweed, by the way. Yeah, this one, seaweed. And of course, rice. All right, itadakimasu. Such a hearty dinner that I have here, guys. Very delicious uh, grilled fish. And then this uh, <coughs> grilled chicken. All right, guys, good morning. So fast forward, yeah. Last night I slept uh, so well. Yeah, I slept like, I think, eight hours. Uh, I was so tired and I was so shattered when I arrived here because, again, as I mentioned last night in the previous video, I arrived too late. And uh, so, you know, um, I just slept, you know, uh, make use of the time and, you know, uh, gain, uh, gain back the energy. And I saw a hotel, it's called Basilan Business Hotel. It used to be thriving and, uh, you know, this is the popular accommodation here in Basilan. But I don't think they are operational now. Yeah, because uh, prior to, prior to, you know, to come here, I checked that one, but uh, they said it's close for renovation. Yeah. And it's uh, early morning, so let's try to grab some breakfast. Let's see if we can get it here somewhere here in this uh, port area. Yeah, that, uh, that area over there. So let's try to find some breakfast. So let's see what we can find here. Oh, I see something like uh, sati. Yeah, I think it's sati. Yeah, look at that. No? So maybe when we can try that one, sati. It's the actually uh, famous here in Sulu Archipelago, not only here in Basilan, but almost here in the uh, southwestern Philippines. Yeah. Okay, so we can try this one. Why not? Vamos. Sigete isa po. That's sati, di ba? Oh, sati, sir. Yeah. Sige, isa, please. Isa. Ano, 30, 40, 50. Uh, uh, different uh, oh, price. 30, 40 to 50 minutes. Let's try to <coughs> eat my first sati. Actually, guys, this is my first time, <coughs> my first sati in my entire life. <laughs> okay, there we go. So, this is a chicken, yan, right? oh, chicken. Uh -huh. and then uh, kanin. What is the sauce? Niya? Pistachios. And it's a little Okay. Try it. Looks, uh, looks good. Okay. So let's dig in, let's try this one. My first sati. <laughs> I just had uh, my first bite of sati, yeah? It's really good, it tastes good. So yummy. Yeah, the sauce, mm. delicious.
And uh, that's the uh, grilled chicken. Okay. Okay. She is actually the owner. What is your name, Te? Rohaina. Huh? Rohaina. Hello, Te. Nice to meet you. And then, yeah, she owns this place. And yeah, very delicious, yummy sati. Yeah. And actually, it comes uh, in different sizes and, of course, price. So, like, 30, 40, and 50, no? Variety. Yeah, so. So, I chose the... Oh, 40 pesos are price of sati. Really good, really yummy here, guys. So it's just uh, right here, close to the port. Yeah, this is... Uh, uh, anong name na ano? Bolivar, Bolivar. Ne, itong place Coast mo? Coast Guard. Huh? Bolivar, Coast Guard. Coast okay, so, I see. So her place is just close to Bolivar, the Coast Guard. Yeah, so if you come to, you know, happen to visit here, in Isabella, yeah. Uh, get uh, Rohaina's... Rohaina, right? Eh? Rohaina's uh, sati. Delicious sati. <laughs> Magka mag anak kayo? Oh, anak ko ah, anak mo. Ah. Yung ko yung I see. Sa ka nag school? National. Face to face na ba? Okay. Pero okay. limited pa ngayon. Limited pa rin. Okay. Yes, actually here in the Philippines, we have already started the face to face classes uh, in the classroom. You know, because we already know uh, the past uh, <coughs> two years it's a pandemic you know so it's limited it's only online but now uh, it's already a face-to-face -face class so this is actually the sauce uh, that comes with the uh, sati so that makes your sati experience complete and of course this is the rice so they just actually uh, uh, you know cut it into pieces yeah so it's, it looks like this now so what did I order? Right, there's actually a new customer and then uh, she's trying to prepare it for her and there we go. Wow. Alright, so I just had my party sati breakfast for the first time as I mentioned. Okay. Right, and uh, I, I enjoy chatting with the locals here. Uh, yeah. Uh, giving me some instructions or, or recommendations, you know, what to see and what to experience here in, uh, in Basila. Alright, so let's proceed now because uh, it's already 8 in the morning. Okay, thank you guys. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's, it's raining. It's not raining, but it's okay. Hopefully, it, it will stop anytime soon. Okay, so I'm on, I'm on my way to the Isabella City Plaza, you know, the main uh, city square and uh, still it's raining it hasn't stopped yet but uh, all right it's okay okay uh, I see this church so this must be the, the largest uh, church here in, in Basilan Catholic Church I mean yeah and actually it's called uh, Santa Isabel Cathedral or uh, Saint Santa Isabel of Portugal Church Alright, a quick uh, church visit is done. Now let's head to the public plaza they have here, the city square. <laughs> so cute, guys. Here it is. Yeah, nice one. Alright, there, there's Jollibee here. Look. Okay, I believe this is the only Jollibee in uh, Sulu Archipelago. Alright, so guys, by the way, Sulu Archipelago. Uh, it's actually part of the country here in the part of the uh, you know southwestern Philippines uh, that consists of three provinces all right so we have Basilan uh, Sulu okay and uh, Tawi-Tawi I've been to Tawi-Tawi shout out to Tawi-Tawi uh, friends okay and here in Sulu archipelago I believe this is the only Jollibee they have here yeah look at that <laughs> so again guys uh, to my foreigner followers Jollibee is is a country's uh, number one fast food chain. So its main rival is McDonald's. You know, some people say uh, some people say that 
you know, McDonald's is like almost number one to any other countries in the world, but the Philippines. Because in the Philippines, Jollibee is the leading one. <laughs> All right, so it's time for my sugar fix. So I'll, I'll, I need a Coca-Cola for me to continue, okay? Because uh, I'm running out of energy already, even though it's yeah. not so hot. <laughs> Hello. Although it's not so hot, but uh, you know, I I was uh, walking around for like uh, an hour or two already. You know, just try to explore the local uh, uh, sites here in Isabella. So it's time for me to grab my sugar fix, which is Coca-Cola. So I found something here, okay? I asked uh, some random source here and they don't have and but this one they have it here so let me grab mine hey hello good morning Coca-Cola to ah quanto vale Coca-Cola? 25 pesos 25 pesos okay uh, alright so 25 pesos okay let me just uh, pay that it's up please and they also uh, sell some snacks here so we have uh, banana cake yeah this is banana cake and this is pancake or we call it locally as hot cake. Uh, this is kuchinta, no? Kuchinta. And uh, pudding. So pudding is actually recycled bread. Uh, you know, they, they process it again and then you have this pudding. Yeah. But I kind of like this. Makano to siya? Dose. Sige, isa please, ha? Dose. Banana cake for snack. Pair with my Coca Cola. Hello, what is your name? Micah. Micah. Hi, Micah. And you? Maika also. Maika, really? <laughs> ah, okay, so different spelling, but Maika. Okay. Hi, Maika, hello. <laughs> Alright, they just told me that uh, they uh, have a picture taken with uh, Pulas becoming Filipino. Yeah, it's actually a famous, this Canadian, famous vlogger here in the Philippines. Yeah, shout out to you, Pulas. Yeah, I actually, you know, uh, at the time of pandemic, you know, when the pandemic started. Actually, uh, Pulas uh, video is my are my uh, are my go-to videos. Yeah, so that's why uh, he inspired me of doing the vlog. Actually, yeah, that's very uh, very true. So you have a picture taken with Pulas? Yeah. Ay marilimte. Giro tayo. Anong name mo? Chris. Si si Ati Chris. Yeah. Hello, Ati Chris. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Pulas. Um, taka dito katalaga den, yeah. Isabella. Okay. Yeah, Isabella locals, guys. Basilan locals. Okay. Uh, so again, as I mentioned a while ago, uh, I mean, or in the pre previously, that the one of the languages here in Basilan is Chavacano. And then this is actually how it sounds. Can you do Chavacano? Okay. Yeah. I, I will ask you. Yeah. I will ask you, but uh, please answer me in Chavacano. Okay. Yeah. Ano ba pumunta sa Paul sa Bukol Paul? Ah, may ano? Munta lang to tricycle. Okay. 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 Ayan. Okay. Ayan. Okay. Ayan. Okay. Ayan. Okay. Ayan. Okay. 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 Cuando it's hablas, like parang, ano man say, it's quite, yeah, quite similar, yeah. No? Similar. Actually, actually, Spanish naman siya, pero may mix na lang, di ba? Yeah, again, Chabacano is, uh, it's, it's really uh, Spanish, but it's just uh, as mixtures of uh, other words from, like, for example, local dialects here in the Philippines, like Cebuano, Iligayno, and whatnot. So, that's actually how Chabacano sounds from the local here. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Gracias. <laughs> Gracias. Okay, I've seen so many provincial capital buildings, and this is my first time to see in which the color is blue. There you go. <laughs> yeah, so that's a Bas uh, Basila provincial capital, and the color is blue. I kind of like the design. Yeah, uh, Muslim inspired or Islamic inspired architecture. Yeah. So again, it's just right in front of uh, Jollibee. That. So guys, uh, as you know, it's raining the whole morning, okay? And actually walking is a bit of a challenge for me because, you know, these slippers, I can't show them because uh, uh, it's very dirty. They are very dirty. The, the slippers that I'm wearing, 
are actually, you know, they don't have a uh, good grip, so I'm trying to buy a new pair. Yeah, new pair of slippers. Here, let's try to find if they have. actually 120 pesos yeah so they are looking for my uh, size let me try this all right so I just bought a new pair of slippers all right and I'm now heading back to the accommodation where I stay here in Isabella and I'll show it to you okay it's called the Casa Rosario so it's actually a, a bit of a walk but not really like maybe 30 seconds for you to get to the um, you know reception area all right so this is how it looks like here it's actually very close to the uh, port area so again this is the name Rosario pension or also known as Casa Rosario so this is the uh, you know uh, garden area they have here Hi. yeah and uh, yeah such an amazing location it's very comfortable very close to uh, the port Okay, now let's get inside the room. I'll show it to you how it looks like. I'll give you a room tour. Yeah. So this is, this is my room, room 201. Let's get in. Ta-da! Okay, basically it's just a basic room, you know, where, uh, with a air conditioning system that works well. <laughs> so yeah, this is my bed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then my, uh, of course, my bag. So they have uh, two sets of uh, small tables here. Yeah, uh, with two sockets. And here, here's the bathroom. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, just basic, but uh, uh, already good for me. Um, comfortable. Yeah, as long as the air conditioning system, you know already that. No, I always mention that every time I give you a house tour. Uh, that works well. That works for me. Yeah, and it's actually a comfy bed. In fairness. Yeah, and uh, the room here costs. Uh, oh my God, it's so dark. Let me find a good light. There you go. Uh, the room here costs uh, one thousand pesos per night. Yeah. So guys, if you like this video, please let me know by clicking the like button. All right, and please subscribe down below if you haven't done it yet. If you haven't done it yet, <laughs> done it yet, done it yet, and also uh, hit the notification bell. All right. See you on the next video. Bye for now. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa.